three years ago with uh, Mathieu, uh, Jacomi, and uh, Eduardo. We presented at FOSDEM in Brussels possibilities to actually migrate or Jeffy to the web or at least uh, yep. have something similar to uh, a web-based Jeffy. The thing is, at that point, we established that we have uh, quite a powerful uh, graph rendering engine now uh, that has been developed by uh, Guillaume, uh, who must be with you right now, and uh, me mainly, and help with other people, including Benoit. Uh, we also have a um, huge set of uh, implementations for various graph algorithms, including Force Atlas 2, which is kind of one of the huge pillars of uh, JP right now, and also community detection, page rank, lots of metrics, etc. So we have good opportunities here to start working on um, JP on the web. Uh, also, we have lots of implementations of things. So there's these prototypes that have been developed uh, by people, including me, at Media Lab Science School like 10 years ago or something. Uh, we have Retina that you just show, uh, that you just saw, sorry, uh, and that will be used for exporting graphs from Jeffy now. There's also Minivan that has been designed and developed by my brother, Mathieu. And uh, sorry, I keep going on those. Uh, Nancy that is currently being developed by Guillaume and Robin at Media Lab. And also we uh, at Westware, we developed recently the front end of Draft Commons. So basically, we know that we can do something uh, very similar to Jeffy on the web page. Uh, we, we don't have huge technical issues anymore. And um, the most important thing was that all together around the table, we discussed if we want to do this and and if we do, what should be this uh, new thing? So we decided to, to come up with Jeffy Light that should come quite soon, I'd say. And I hope to have something working before Christmas that will be another team working on another product that is branded and uh, owned under mm -hmm. the Jeffy banner and brand. And uh, basically, the most important thing is it should be familiar to to Jeffy users. It should be light. I mean, it should never be more complicated than Jeffy is right now. And it should handle most common use cases of Jeffy with most common graph sizes. So unfortunately for you, your huge Twitch map won't be handleable yeah. by Jeffy Light, but who knows, maybe at some point. Yeah. <laughs> and um, I spent some time working on this specifications draft, hoping to, to start the discussion. And Paul and Mathieu and Guillaume also uh, have already joined. So nice. that's something new and we'll have to, to see if it evolves properly now. As Mathieu is saying in the chat, we are doing the web version of Jiffy. Drop the mic. It's quite a, a huge uh, strategic ambition for Giffy as technologies. A lot of technologies are migrating to the web for accessibility accessibility and uh, it was uh, yes there are questions about the demo but no it's not uh, available yet alexi you spoke about uh, maybe christmas yeah that's I, i'd like to have a running prototype before christmas okay Oh, it would be so great. Alexis, this is Clément. I realize I should ask my questions as an issue on, on the Giphy Light repo. That would be uh, more productive, but let me go this way. That would be super interesting to think as well about how the Giphy Light web app could uh, plug back to the Giphy desktop app. Because at the moment, the direction we have just started with is the, you know, you export stuff to the web and nice and super. But I'm just intrigued uh, and curious about uh, the use case and how would it be meaningful and productive to have to open the possibility for a user to have a workflow on the web and at some point to branch to uh, working on the desktop and how to make that easy and and uh, and, and uh, seamless so it's just a comment and um, yeah we probably should be able to do something like this uh, as we can open a Zoom from a web browser, for instance. Today, uh, now, nowadays, we have a bit of uh, difficulties to find Java developers to help us to maintain to maintain uh, Giphy software. But developing uh, this Giphy Lite 
is uh, like a new path for other kind of developers and new technologies. What can you tell about it to us? I'm sure you're right. I think it's going to be easier to find uh, React TypeScript developers and Java developers. Yeah. Uh, but it's also a opportunity because we will be able to move faster than Jeffy, maybe. Yeah. Uh, in which case, uh, maybe we can try things on Jeffy Lite and if it works well, implement the, the good feature only once in Jeffy.